Hello and welcome back. So today I thought I would do something super fun where I get Dylan to see me wear my most iconic dresses, my like red carpet dresses, different dresses I wore on the show, in real life, photo shoots, whatever, and I thought you would react to them. So basically my mom came out to California and she brought all of these dresses that I had at home. Some have lasted throughout the years, some throughout the move were like given away, things like that, but I tried to hold on to like a lot of the main ones for the most part. So I'm just gonna get him to literally react and rate them because I'm sure a lot of these are no longer in style. Some of these might fit a little funky and some of these just, I don't know, I just wanna hear what you think. I kinda wanna try and guess when you wore them. That's a good idea, why don't we do that? I like that. Awesome. So I'm the idea guy. Guess where I wore them to and see if you know and then you have to rate them. Okay, easy. Yeah, let's do it. Don't open yet. One, two, three. Oh, okay. Oh, I like that. You know where I wore this? Did you wear it on night one of The Bachelor? I did. I'm gonna start with like a basic, obvious one. Like, you would obviously guess this. That one's good. I like that one. You do? Yeah, you're probably. I'm a fan of that one. I think I got it and it had to be like three or four days or so before I went out to LA to start like filming. And it fit perfectly. Like It still does. I'm shocked kind of that it fits. There's probably like sweat all over it. Um, I never washed it, it's probably really gross. It literally lived in my suitcase while we traveled all over the place. Like it was in, I had two suitcases. It was in this other one at like the very bottom. So, would I get your first impression rose? I'm just kidding. Yes. Really? Yeah, I, th I thought you looked the best the first night. Oh, thank you. So I would recognize that dress anywhere. Thank you. And with that. What's it out of, 10 or five? 10. Okay. Can you see it? No. Oh, nine. Nine? We're going nine out of 10. Why not 10? Because you wore that to a date with another person. So obviously I can't 10 out of 10 that. Fair. Love you. Love you. That looks good. I like that one. I, was, I didn't know where you're going to come out with first. Yeah. That one looks good. This one. Yeah. One, two, three. Why are you laughing at me? <laughs> that one's good. I, I don't know, I don't like that one. I'm not gonna, I don't like that one. I'm not gonna lie. Did you, uh, Guess where I wore it to. Uh, prom? I wore it to a college formal. Really? Yeah. Are you not into what, it? Whatever is going on over here should be not happening. Okay. It honestly would look 50 times better without that. Oh my God, what is that? <laughs> what is that? What is under your dress? It just is part of dresses. Like a lot of dresses, they have it to like make it flow out. <laughs> All right, that one. I, did your other dress have this? No. This one. It's canceled. Um, it's canceled. We're not even using blue. Wait, let me. So while you're thinking of your rating, let me explain. Um, I actually don't know where I got this dress. I think I might have borrowed it from one of my sorority sisters. Fits, the color works, it's simple. I don't completely hate it, I really don't. I think it's got a nice fit to it. It barely, y'all barely zipped. But, yeah. What's your rating? I tried to draw a four. Oh, that looks good. Uh, it looks okay. It looks, cool. it's, I'm, not the, I'm not the biggest fan of it. Do you like that dress? Would you wear it again? No. I don't hate it though. I don't know what it is. I think for like a red, like if you're going to um, a war <laughs> show. Yeah. An maybe, award show, yeah. like it's kind of cool. I, I mean, honestly, maybe the color is kind of cool. I guess I'm just not. It's just not my typical style. I'm too small minded right now. I'm just like imagining you just like wearing that at a party. But I guess a red carpet, like a formal event. That would look cool without the bow. Cool. I wouldn't let you out with the bow on. Therefore, I will not wear it again. One, two, three. There's a lot of cleavage on that one. I like it though. Yes, there is. I like it. I know where you wore that. I watched that one, that interview. Well, what? Where did I wear this to? I heard. Yeah. Okay. 
So story about this, Lori, my publicist, was like, yeah, we're gonna go to iHeartRadio. I had just gotten off the first show, like did After the Final Rose or whatever. She's like, yeah, we're gonna go to iHeartRadio, like bring an extra dress. And I was like, okay, cool. I thought I was like attending it to where it was like a concert kind of thing. And then literally the day before she was like, no, 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 like you're on, like what are your options? Like you're actually on the red carpet. And I was like, wait, what? I like had no clue just cause it was all so new to me still. We went to this place and it was House of CB. And I oh, tried, I that one. really? Yeah. yeah, it's they have cool stuff. And I saw this on the mannequin, tried it on. Luckily, very luckily, it fit great. And so I was like, yeah, let's do it. And then we had like hair and makeup and they're like, we're gonna like, I was like, I wanna do something different. I always look like my hair down and stuff. And it was my first like red carpet of me like actually being on the carpet. Bradley and Jared, my hair and makeup, they like gave me a slick pony. It was really sick and like, really cool like darker makeup and I remember we showed up and I like got a glimpse of the carpet and I was like so nervous I was like wait like this is like more intense than I thought I thought it'd be like low-key like okay here's a picture yay whatever but like it was like legit at least for me like for most people it's probably like not pulled up and I like for some reason all of a sudden I like channeled this like Yes, I literally had bad bitch energy and I was just I like went out there and I just like owned it and I was just like posing like I knew what I was doing. Oh wait, I've seen this one. It's really? Like, it's like this. Right. Yes, it is. It is very similar. So they're like, Hannah <laughs> in my head I was like, what in the hell am I doing? Like I was just like kind of like tried to work with it. Did that, ended up sitting right right behind Taylor Swift. There was like some video where they zoomed in on her, not me obviously, but I was in the background and I was like, I was behind Taylor Swift, Alicia Keys, John Legend. I was sitting next to Drake Be Bell from Drake and Josh. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> he had no clue who I was. Really cool experience, really fun, and I feel like it was a fun dress. I am kind of sweating in this, and I just remembered that like, I think I was sweating my butt off like the what? whole night. Is it like hot? It's definitely hot. All right, time to rate. Time to rate. Eight. Eight! We like this one. Makes your butt look fantastic. Oh, really? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Excuse do. me. I think it's like the iridescent or something. No, your first dress is the best one so far. Well, you can still give them whatever you want. I oh, am. Yeah. What would you change about Today. this one? I don't know. Maybe the sleeves and the shortness are throwing me off. Cause it's long sleeves, but it's a short dress. All right, well, next dress. Eight though, we like that one. Three, two, one. I like that one. Yeah, I've always liked that one. It's from Paradise, yeah. You know all of these. Yeah, no, I thought you looked fantastic in that. You liked this one? Yeah. I don't know what week this was, but I saw it in my closet and I was like, oh. It was later this on. This little polka dot one, super cute. Yeah, it was later on. I liked that one. That one was good. That was a good night for me. Was it? Yeah, it was a good night for me. He would do this thing every single day in paradise. And you still do it, but not quite as much. It was every day. Every time I walked down the stairs. Every amazing. time you showed up, whether you were in like a group or whatever, I'd be like, holy shit, she's hot. <laughs> I was like, wow. Or, or I'd start cheering. He'd I'd start, be, he'd be like, like, yes, Hannah. Great job. <laughs> Wait, I gotta, I, I gotta gas you up. Sweet, thank you. I love this one though. You, should I rewear it? Mm-hmm. Okay. We're going 10. What? We give this one a 10. Better I didn't know you dress. liked it that much. Yeah, it's perfect. Fits you great. It's like perfect length. And you- I should you really just, see it. You go, with, you go with the dress really well. I feel like you're a polka dot girl. You like me in polka dots? I just feel like that's your vibe. Hmm. Okay. Polka dots are playful, beachy, classy. Listen. Maybe I should be in fashion. Okay, cool. Anyway, next dress. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> this this has to be prom of some sort, or like homecoming. It's actually my future wedding dress. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. No. What? No. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> It Can you imagine? You, it makes you look like you have double D. I wore this in a pageant. Okay, that makes um, sense. And I literally could not get it up. Like, try. I tried out for Miss Alabama USA three times. This was the last year I did it, and I got first runner up and Miss Congeniality. 
That's the one you want to win is Miss Congeniality. Yes. That's what I won in this. I didn't win Miss Alabama <laughs> USA. Shout out Sandra Bullock. It's a fantastic movie. Shout out Sandra. I have like a little tail. I do like a spin. I don't know if I can up here. I could never wear dresses like that. I wasn't really like a pageant girl growing up. I just kind of like tried it out. So I actually, I kind of think I like it more than the blue one. Oh. I think the blue, like the bow really threw me off on the blue one. And I, maybe I was too harsh on it. Are you looking at everything? You can be honest. If it's like outdated or if it's whatever. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want you to wear that. Only because I, I think it's, well, hold on, let me rephrase that. Not that I wouldn't want you to wear it. You can wear whatever you want. It's very outdated. Okay. Is what I would say. Okay, I'm gonna go six. Oh, ouch. Now I see why I didn't win Miss Alabama USA. <laughs> but you won Miss Congeniality because it's so fun. Only, maybe, listen, the second you start getting into the seven ranges, seven ranges are, are you can rewear those in the seven range, in my mind. Seven to 10. You can rewear that. The 10 for the blue, you could wear literally any time. The other dress, you could wear same thing. I, I feel very strongly about this decision. But, you still look beautiful. Oh, this is a short dress. <laughs> okay. One, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen this before or no? I don't think I've seen that before. Where did, where did you wear that? Um, okay, so I wore this at my um, After the Final Rose episode. Hmm. Have you not seen it? No. Oh, yeah, it's fine. Um, no, but I know you said you wanted someone to jump a fence for you. Would really you? <laughs> Do much more than that. Bill. I like it though. Yeah, so, okay, I got this thing from Revolve. Honestly, it's still really cute. That was like how many years ago? I'm a single arm guy. Oh wait, this is supposed to be poofy. I think if you wear one arm on, one arm off, like shoulder, cool. I think it's cool. I remember I was like trying on different dresses for it. This is from Revolve. And I remember I was like trying on different dresses and like there were some that like looked really good and typically that I would wear was like simple, not anything unique. And at the time, the one arm sleeve thing was like, and the puppy sleeve, it was like a new trend. If I was a girl, I'd wear a lot of, of one arm. I remember I tried this on and I was like, I'm just gonna be a little different this year. Like whatever, green is kind of a new color at the time. So I liked it. I thought it was kind of like a power move. I like this one. We'll use green in honor. Should I do like a runway walk? Yeah, do a runway walk. tough one. I take these ratings seriously. I know. That's why I thought you'd be good at it. I think I think I know what I'm gonna go. We're gonna go 8.5. Oh, that's good. 8.5. The debate was between an 8 and a 9, so I decided you know when it's a 9, you know when it's not. So I went 8.5. I like it. I'm a single arm guy. You appealed to the judge. And I agree. Green's a good color. Why, what, what is the 1.5 that like didn't work for you? I think that was a little more to the side. <laughs> I think I would have liked that. <laughs> um, and then maybe if the shoulder wasn't poofy. You don't like the poofy shoulder? I don't like the poofies. Tough <laughs> crowd. Listen, listen, Tough listen. crowd. Listen, it looks good though. I like that one. All right, on to the next. Three, two, one. See, I liked this one. I know you never ended up wearing it, right? Correct, I've never worn this. She never wore this, <laughs> but I liked this one because this was for our reunion show for Paradise. Mm -hmm. I was so close to wearing this. I like it, but I'm not, I'm not a big like sparkles guy. 
So I love this dress and I will definitely be wearing it sometime. It was in between this and the blue dress, which I could not find. I was going to try it on for you, but I the blue dress think great. I gave it away. Yeah, I like the blue one a lot. Yeah, so we went with blue, but I brought this one even like in the trailers. We had to change it and stuff. I was still wasn't sure, but then I ended up just like seeing this and I was like, these kind of look like nips a little. And I was like, maybe it'll look like that. Like in pictures, I don't care, but like... Front, yeah. It's like our first time being engaged. I didn't want to be too blinged out. So I will be wearing this sometime. Lisa, our stylist, picked it out for me. It was going to be like with silver shoes. What do you guys think about this one? I don't know. But I feel like I'll be wearing it sometime. We're going to go nine. Really? We give this one a nine. You like this one more than the last one? Than the green one? Yeah. Yeah. Really? And it's, it, see, it's tough. And maybe this is a knee-jerk reaction. I'm not an orange guy. It's orange. It, it, I don't know. I don't. I don't like the color. But it fits you well. I do like this design. I don't. I'm not big sparkles, but I like that it's like fitted, formed kind of thing, outlined. I, I feel like cool. you like different stuff. I, I like simple, like more flattering stuff. I feel like you you appreciate a bold fashion choice, even if it's not liked by everyone. I think you like it. Or you think it's cool and I take risks. Yeah. Uh, that's why I give that one a nine. That one was easy. That one, yeah. I'm feeling good about this one. We go pink. Okay. okay. All right. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah. <laughs> that's the one, folks. The one I wear my birthday? No. <laughs> this one is what she got engaged in. She had no idea what was coming. And now you're going to look at you. I like Do you it. like it? I like it. I think it's fun. I don't think it's a formal dress though. It's not. It's beachy. It was hot. It's yeah, it's day. super beachy, which I like. Like you could, and if we went to like Hawaii, I could totally rewear it. Yeah, you could totally rewear that. I was gonna have to borrow somebody's dress. It was either gonna be one of the girls or one of the producers' dresses because I ran out of dresses completely in paradise. Like I brought so many, I wore every single one, and I remember I took out every single one in the hotel room, and then I found this one like. It was like behind all my underwear and stuff. And I thought, I guess I thought it was underwear the whole time. And I was like, okay, this is the last one I have. Like I'll wear it. Like I didn't even save it for something important. Like I had no clue that that day was going to be that big, but I put it on and I was like, oh, I'm kind of like digging it. Like it, it's like not too short. It's no. like flowy. It's kind of chill. It's flowy yeah. and fitted, which yeah. I like. <laughs> and then you ended up wearing the same color. It matched really well. Yeah. Little did I know, like, this little dress and the back of my underwear suitcase would be They're not gonna have one of you. the most important dresses of my life, so. They're not going to have you out there and, uh, and, and me wearing, like, gold while you're wearing that. What is the rating on this dress? You can be honest. I also tried to prank him a second ago to see if I was like, this dress is so ugly, what do you think? I posted on TikTok, I don't know if it'll be up by the time I put this up, but if it is, you'll see a clip of it here. If not, whatever, but I tried to prank him, but it, he was not pranked at all. I can realize that. It was a I've rewatched that scene a million times. <laughs> and the video has like 300 views on YouTube or like a million views and I've, I have to be 45% of them. Yeah. Well, this rating comes based on the the fact the time and where fashion is today it comes based on your ability to rewear the dress, the fit, the colors, my mood. I did eat a lot of chips, so I feel good now. What do you think that dress is worth? I don't know. What number would you give it? I don't know. Mm, so the dress doesn't invoke confidence in you. Looks like I have to change my score. No, I'm just kidding. All right, we went 10. <laughs> Yay! We, we give that one a 10. Why? <laughs> because I love Hawaii, I love the beach. I feel Why? like you could wear that. I feel like you could wear that everywhere. <laughs> Do you have a good memory with this dress? <laughs> what? Do you have a good memory attached to this dress? Uh, not really, I was pretty blacked out that day. Um, all I know is, <laughs> I like woke up, I walked down, things got a little hazy, and then I was calling my mom, telling her I was engaged, so. 
kind of depends how you look at it. Yeah. But yeah, good memory. Something like a, 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 about starting our life together, and I was ready for that to start now. The, the do you trust me was a Yeah, I was gonna say, do you trust me? I think that was. Do you trust me was electric. That was a good one. Do that you was trust it. Me was electric. That was a great one. Listen. Thank you. I'm gonna write a book of smooth lines. It's gonna be called The Smooth Operator. And yeah, we go, we go 10 with that dress. 10. Okay, so with that being said, there are all of my dresses. I think you crushed it. You guessed basically all of them, which I don't know if I'm surprised. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised. I'd seen all of them. Yeah. Except for two. Yeah. And I guessed the other two. Yeah. That was a pageant dress, the white one. And the green one. I didn't know the green one. I guess that's true. And I didn't know the blue one. Wait, did I know any of them? <laughs> <laughs> um, anyways, um, make sure to subscribe, pretty please, it helps so much. Make sure to comment your favorite dress below. And if I should do some type of fun, like prom dress giveaway this year, I've always wanted to do one, so I feel like that would be really fun and cool. And yeah, you guys have an amazing day.